All right, just uh, went to the guy. Uh, first, let me start like that. All right. I had all stay uh, in the, uh, the beginning of the year, December. From now, I got all stay. So what had happened was um, they hit my account for six hundred and sixty-one dollars. Uh, a little bit more than a month ago. So I called. For some reason, they weren't able to get it, but they they tried or whatever. And so uh, I ended up calling them. I was like, "Hey, no, I had got a notification that that's what they that's what the bill is, or some some or some of that nature." And so. Uh, I was like, hey man, seven hundred dollars. You know, at one time that ain't what I signed up for, and so on, so on. I was, I was only supposed to be paying like one seventy five a month. You know, I still thought that was too high, two hundred a month, because I was trying to get my uh, Michigan driver's license. I had Texas driver's license. Problem with my Texas driver's license, so I was trying to get Michigan uh, driver's license. So I had to get insurance and all this, you know, uh, from there. And so, um, after the man told me, oh, no, no, I'm charging you uh, 660 a month, that's too high, that's too high. Uh, my bad, we're going to get it straightened out, and we're going to just charge you 175 So I said, all right. A week later, they hit my account. I had, of course, you know, I had like uh, a couple of thousand and all, whatever, uh, an Amazon bonus and all that from there, and my, you know, some tax return, you know, was coming up, girl, had, had just happened or was about to happen. And so, bam, they hit me for the six, uh, 660. It looked like a thousand dollars was gone because whatever else I spent. Uh, so when it showed how much, uh, when they took the 660, from the last time I checked, it looked like a thousand. I was like, oh, no, no. Anyway, they did it yesterday, day before yesterday. Hit me for another 660. Whoop, I call. They say that my insurance wasn't finalized with did I have insurance. Of course I got insurance. I work at Amazon. You know what I'm saying? I got insurance. Man, I just went to the uh, foot doctor, the uh, podiatrist or something like that. But anyway, uh, yeah, I got insurance. So they telling me they sent some paperwork out. All right, I used to stay in Southfield. I used to stay in Southfield, but now I live on Eight Mile. I lived on Eight Mile in Southfield, but I stay I stay on East Eight Mile. So they must have sent the insurance papers for me to sign to Southfield. From there, I never got them. But what happened was I e signed everything through my email with the agent on the phone. I got two cell phones, so he walked me through it on the phone when I done it, so I know for a fact. But anyway, so in a little bit more than 60 days, they didn't charge me over 1300 for car insurance. I hit the ceiling. I'm just like, oh, no. Every time they do it, I text my woman. She she, she works uh, days, I work nights. So I text her, man, I just hit my bank account. You know, blah, 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 about $700, boo, boo. You know, she'll give me instructions. Hey, do this, do that. Call, call, uh, do it now, do it now. I'm like, all right, bam. So, I go, I got a bank that's inside of Walmart, but the original one I was dealing with was out in Southfield. Um, Michigan First Credit Union. So, anyway. They got one over here on East 14, 14 or something. So I drive up to the Walmart, boom, boom. And uh, dude tell me, okay, he'll uh, discredit the, the, the transaction and give me my money. You know, put it back in my account and so on, so on, so on. We get to start it and we get all the way through. My woman had to call, happened to call while I was on the phone, so I put on speakerphone. Well, I'm talking to her. I ain't put on speakerphone, so I'm talking to her and him at the same time. 
at the last second he telling me I'm not going to get my money is going to take a week or whatever and so on so on. I was like, that ain't what you told me. You know what I'm saying? So I don't trip. I say, all right, from there. He give me back my card and tell me my car is still going to work. I go to work that night. My car don't work. I don't keep no cash on me. I keep, you know, a couple of dollars worth of change in the cup holder or whatever. But I told my woman, hey, let me hold uh, $20. You know what I'm saying? She said, honey, boom. So I had $20 on me. Uh, I go to swipe my card. I couldn't even buy soda. I said, hold on. I was somewhere else and swipe for some food or whatever. And so now I'm using the $20. Now I had to buy some cigarettes or something. And it didn't go through on the card. And I'm like, what the fuck? Anyway, they credited my account this morning for the Allstate. Bam. My paycheck ain't there. So I go to check. Is that my paycheck or is that, you know, $700? Is that my paycheck? Boom, boom. Hell no. I'm on the phone with my woman. And... I was letting her know they credited my account. So I go to check the, the bank account. I mean, you know, my uh, Amazon account. Amazon paid me 1100 I'm like, hell no. You know what I'm saying? Boo, boo. So I called the bank. And guess what? Guess what? Oh, so while I'm at the, the gas station talking to her, that's how long it took for the 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 bank to finally uh, pick up once I got to the gas station. She said it's already there. So time I got through talking to her, boom. I get out the car. It's a dude coming out, a black dude coming out out of car dealership. I say, say, man, you fuck with him? He said, huh? I say, uh, he said, yeah, he worked. Long story short, my phone rang and I'm in the quick. He was like, hey, you ain't got to worry about credit check. Just come with your down payment, your money right, and you can get anything on that lot. And so that's what I'm happy about. Now I found Hold on. So I'm going to end this video. Hold on. That's my other phone. I thought it was uh, this phone. So that's my point. Now, the brother that was coming out the, the car dealership that's right next door to the car lot next door to the, uh, the gas station. Like, say, you only need about 25. It started at 2500 You get whatever you want. It's another one called Luxury Motors on East 8 Mile. They got everything. I mean, when I say Benz, it's Range Rover, so on, so on, so on, so on. They got everything. And they say the same thing. So now it's starting to tame for me because my credit score is like mm, at a 600. I need to get it better. That's why I'm doing these uh, little small loans and all this stuff. I've been doing loans to get my uh, credit score up from there. But... I was saying, when something happened, if you take all your energy of being upset, you're going to miss the blessing that's right, I'm talking about right around the corner. You see what I'm saying? If I'd have got blew out of purport and you're upset about the Allstate, they ain't taught me $1,300, in about 60 days, a little bit more than 60 days. Plus the money to start. The start it cost about two hundred. So they got me for like fifteen hundred dollars. Motherfucker, I ain't got full coverage. What the fuck is going on? You know what I'm saying? They told me, oh, this is what happened. On the policy, to get if you got hit in a car, who pay for your doctor bill? I got Amazon insurance, Blue Cross or whatever. I don't need uh and so that's what the, the 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 agent was telling me. He was like, if you already got insurance, it'll save you way more. You'll save way more if you use your own insurance. I said, all right. But he said that multiple times. They telling me that it was never signed and they charging me charge. It, it's a law they say is a default that they got to put the highest insurance it is. Nigga, they was charging me six sixty one a month. And it was, they had my routing number where they just hit my account like prepaid. You know what I'm saying? Prepaid is when you give up the card. You know what I'm saying? The, the number to your card, access to your card, prepaid. Bruh, they got the routing number. 
So if I switch the card, they still can't hit the money. So they done it twice. You know what I'm saying? And they was going to start hitting me for six sixty one a month. Six sixty one a month. And I'm talking about food. Uh, talk to her. She said the the whole six months for six months the the policy bought to be in like thirty three. Uh, it was like three thousand plus for six months. I said, man, ain't nobody. Man, that's a whole motherfucking car. Uh, at the end of the year, that's that's over seven thousand. You know what I'm saying? You put a down payment. What, what your car costs, man? What one year seven thousand? Your car costs over fifteen thousand, fourteen, fifteen thousand. A, a nice little used car. That's how much a car would cost. The whole car would cost fifteen thousand, eighteen thousand, sixteen, seventeen thousand. You know what I'm saying? From there, uh, but now, now I, got, I found the uh, little car lot, and the whole thing is, is it been sitting there the whole time. I've been over here on the east side for almost a year now, working on a year, and uh, never went to the car lot at one at all. Going through all this. It's sitting right there at the gas station I've been going to. Bam. At no point in time did I go say, hey, let me go check this car lot out. And that's the whole secret about life, bro. It could be what what you need is right in front of you, right next door or whatever the situation is. And the whole time, your every day just got you going around it, over it, or behind it, and only thing you got to do, <laughs> it, it's crazy, man. It's crazy. And so, oh, and I'm about to be signing up for uh, Wayne State University uh, Computer Science. All this my, all this time trying to um, do this uh, Python programming, JavaScript programmer or developer or whatever, and now Amazon paying for my tuition as long as I work there. I can get a master's and don't have to pay one dollar. Just as long as I'm working there, they're gonna pay the whole year's salary at a time, one year at a time, one year at a time from there. So we talking about in a short period of time for me, my whole look at things can be totally I'm talking about totally changed. And it's one more thing, one more thing. Um, Wayne State, it was something else I was just about to say. Oh, the stock. The stock. When I first got there uh, at Amazon, they gave me the option to uh, buy stock. I said, yeah, take $50 out a week. Okay. I started in September, some shit like that. Okay. Lo and behold, I'm looking on, on, on Google and Boom, it come up that Amazon is spending $10 billion to buy their stock back from whoever else got it. If an employee has any stock, they're going to give them 20 to 1 to their stock. And I immediately said, oh my God, the numbers 20 times whatever. I know Job lost his, his his house, his kids, and everything. God gave him threefold. Twenty-fold, twenty times the amount. Man, the numbers start running through my head like, oh my God. Hey, was going through situation, you know, from there financially that wasn't making sense. And I'm just shelling money at it, you know, like throwing money in a hole. And boom, that's when the start time. So they make the decision where it will just be a formality this month. So I was trying to buy as much as I could this month. Oh, the stocking went down. It was at uh, 3,000, 3,200 or 3,300. Now it's at 2,000. My money buy more now. Now say, uh, say uh, I was trying to buy a share. If you had three thousand dollars, you only got one share. By being two thousand, you can buy a share and a half because your thousand, the two thousand, bought one share and then you got a thousand over. And the way the broker is doing it, whatever amount of money loans is a, 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 a certain amount, he hold it to it's a certain amount and then put in a package where 
anything over the fifty dollars or a hundred dollars is gonna buy you a percentage of a share. A per you're gonna have at least some type of percentage. So if you did have three, you will have one and a half instead of your three only buying you one share. So buy low, sell high. When it's low and it's a uh, Microsoft, it's a uh, Amazon, it's a uh, uh, what's the boy uh, Tesla, Apple. You know, a company that's going to be there, that's going to be there. Apple phone still a thousand every time they come out brand new. If they stock go down, that's when you want to get in and buy it cheap because eventually it's going to go back up. Amazon, we got peak all holidays. That's when Amazon packages just go through the roof. You know what I'm saying? From there. I've been talking like uh, 15, 16 minutes. I'm going to have to add this to YouTube. To put it to Facebook, because if I try to add this to Facebook, it, it, it'll have my phone locked. All right, I'm going to say one. We'll from there. All right.